Jerry in West Virginia, thanks for holding her on the air. Yes, Alex, good evening. I'm 74, and I've got a couple of questions quickly. Yeah. Uh, the government recently changed the Social Security to government program benefits checks. What's all that about? Well, I don't know specifically what you're getting at, but they've changed federal regulations here and in other countries uh, to start cutting benefits, to start grabbing private pension funds, to start grabbing education funds, 401ks. Uh, we know the pattern. They're lining up here. They've already done it in other countries, Greece, Spain, you name it, to loot the fully funded private funds where you're not even debating that it's untenable. Uh, and, of course, they'll take part of it claiming they're protecting it. Uh, but specifically, what change are you talking about with Social Security? Well, I was just wondering why they have to change a good thing. And what, it's just another camouflage. But secondly, you know, being 74, I'm worried about the chemtrails affecting the Alzheimer's, uh, you know, increase uh, for the elderly oh, because yeah. of the aluminum barium in the air. And no one seems to be talking about that. I'm sure that the kids with autism, you know, are getting a lot of PR. But what about the elderly? I agree. Listen, when you read Department of Energy documents we made films about, it's all public. The aerosol spraying campaign, it's barium salts, lumen dioxide, and they're spraying us with this. And it's admitted, and it's in the London Guardian. And then people just go, oh, nothing's going on. You're absolutely right. Neurological disorders have a parabolic growth rate. And dementia, you name it, is like hitting 30-year-olds now. I mean, we are being hit hard, and it's a cocktail of issues. Bioaccumulated pesticides, vaccination, uh, the chemtrails. You're absolutely right. God bless you, Jerry. It is a serious situation. We're all in it together. And now they're just announcing, you know, oh, it's for your safety. Uh, Pam in Wisconsin, welcome. Hi, Alex. Um, I'm calling from Wisconsin. I'm hoping I can help you and several of your viewers, or a lot of them. Um, are, am I still on air? Yes, you are, ma'am. Okay. Um, H2O2, food grade, hydrogen peroxide. You can order it online. Um, it's supposed to help. It oxygenates your blood just like your oxy powder does. Um, it, it, that helps oxygenate your blood from a cellular level. Um, and there's I have heard that uh, food grade oxygen peroxide is really good, yes. Yes. The other thing that I think is very important for um, uh, kombucha juice is also good for Crohn's disease. Uh, that's got enzymes. Probiotic. Does amazing things to your flora. That's why the feds came in and tried to ban it because it had like, you know, one third of 1% alcohol. Exactly. And the other thing is raw apple cider vinegar with the mother for anything like GERD, um, acid reflux, or... Pam, I did that for a month with Oxy Powder from InfoWarsLife.com, the apple cider vinegar, and it was incredible. Life-changing what it's done for my gastrointestinal tract. Yes, absolutely. Um, I have Crohn's disease. I was diagnosed at 28 years old. I am now coming up on 57 and medication-free for eight years. And it's thanks to those three things, and then along with several of your products, the lung cleanse. Um, I haven't gotten the oxy powder yet because I've been doing the food grade hydrogen peroxide. That's Sounds good to me hey, if it's working. All I know is Bill Gates and others are targeting the gut in their research. They know these vaccines are attacking the gut. We've had all the medical doctors on, and the gut is the key. 70% of our immune system, and I've been doing everything to get my gut healthy, and it's been amazing. The energy what it's done for me, just I don't want to get into details, obviously. It's personal, but it's amazing. God bless you. Thank you so much for the call. Yeah, you can go to any grocery store and get the apple cider vinegar for like $2, $3, a small bottle, 10 bucks for a big jumbo bottle. You start drinking that stuff every day, mixed in with water. I mean, I don't even sell that stuff. I should. Uh, it's just life-changing life-changing, what it does to the flora in your gut. So much better than probiotics. Because uh, the pesticides in the food, all of it just kills the natural bacteria in your gut. You have to have those, folks. Uh, let's go ahead and go to Leslie in South Carolina. Leslie, you're on the air. Hey, Alex. First of all, I'm a really new listener. I started off listening to you back when Ebola struck. Uh, I was a nursing student. I am a nurse. I just finished nursing school, and I was getting conflicting information from national TV. Everything that they were telling us was against what we were taught. And it just didn't seem right. So 
but I started listening to you. Are you there? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And uh, that's how I found you. And everything you were saying was 100% on the money to the point where I went back to my microbiology teacher and told her all about you and told her to tune in and listen. But then I started listening to you more, and you keep bringing up Bill Gates. In psycho <clears throat> psychological nursing, one of the things we learned is um, Bill Gates is a is an autism survivor. Or yeah, Bill Gates something. admits that he's basically Asperger's. Actually, he has Asperger's, and it seems that maybe he's just trying to get more people like him, so he's the norm instead of the abnorm. Well, Bill Gates works about 18 hours a day and, and does whatever the globalists want, and he's, he's like a robot for them. He's really bad news. And uh, he just runs around. He's behind the geoengineering. That's even in mainstream news. He runs those secret programs. He's behind the inoculations, the federalization of schools. He claims it's school choice, but it's the opposite. I mean, Bill Gates is like a George Soros. They just are an energizer bunny of badness. I mean, I, I don't know how to describe it. It's just that they are animated by evil. And I'm not trying to demonize him. It's just that we research these guys. Uh, Warren Buffett's the same deal. They are, they are really bad news. Well, you have opened my eyes about so many things. The vaccinations. I, before starting nursing school, even though I had had chicken pox, not once, but twice, had to get titered. During my titer, they told me I had no immunity. I'd have to go through the vaccinations. I went through the vaccinations. I got horribly sick. Oh, yeah. They promised me that if I never, if I ever tested negative again, that they would not force me to go through them again. Okay? But they forced me to have flu vaccines every year until the end and I will never have another flu vaccine again as long as I live. I never got sick from it and my doctor's really good. I was getting the same flu vaccines they were giving to the medical students so I felt I was pretty safe there. I was about to say they've got, uh, it's on record, better vaccines for the establishment. But the, the chicken pox vaccine made me horribly sick and 1991 they came out with a vaccine for Lyme's disease. I was living up north then where it was rampant, and my ex-husband was a hunter. I took the vaccine. I ended up with degenerative disc disease. Wow. Yeah. How are they going to give you a vaccine to stop a microorganism that's basically in the syphilis family? They can't do it. It's like the diarrhea vaccine they gave kids. They had to ban because it killed so many. I mean, it, 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 they, they call it vaccine for learned immunity. It's not like it's a polio vaccine. It, it's just government-engineered, globalist-engineered garbage they inject the, you know, they now have anti-stress vaccines, mental illness vaccines, where viruses go in and eat parts of your brain. It's called a lobotomy. And it's so Buck Rogers, it's so over the top that the public has no idea what they're facing. I'm out of time. Thank you, Leslie. Gabriel, Justin, Judith, I'm out of time. But you know what? Let's just go to Judith. Give her 30 seconds, Gabriel and Justin. Go ahead, Judith. You're on the air. Time caller, long time listener. Uh, when my daughter was three years old, took her to the doctor, gave her a TP, DPT shot. Five days later, she still had a fever. Doctor said they were going to put it in the medical history book, that it was from the pertussis that he had just given her five days before. Told me never, never, never give her a pertussis vaccination again. He said she was allergic to it. Fast forward a few decades later, neighbor moves in, has a 24-year-old brother-in-law who would have been four months old at the time my daughter was three years old, gave him a DPT shot, lobotomized him, completely made Oh, yeah, everybody's got victims. That, that's the thing. It's their Brian Williams moment. The whole fraud's collapsing. It's, the whistleblowers are coming out of the government everywhere. The doctors they demonize are being exonerated, Wakefield and others. That's why they're tripling down now saying take it there are no side effects don't listen arrest whoever doesn't take it because their whole criminal operation is coming down they can be defeated sorry the other callers i'm out of time see you back tomorrow live 11 a.m central infowars.com pray for us we're praying for you 
The month of February is all about Valentine's Day. Big heart-shaped boxes filled with delicious candy. What if we, the Patriots, hijacked Valentine's Day and instead made it about human liberty and individual empowerment? I'm all about human potential. I'm all about the individual being empowered. The establishment is the opposite. That's why they spike our water with fluoride, GMO, estrogen mimickers, and the rest of the garbage. InfoWars is striking back in the month of February with Human Empowerment Month. How we can come together and win the human race. And to celebrate the kickoff of Human Empowerment Month, we're slashing prices on InfoWarsLife.com products like Super Male and Super Female Vitality. The sale is only running for the month, 20% off, and there's a lot of other powerful specials at InfoWarsLife.com. InfoWarsLife.com, celebrating human potential in the month of February. Visit InfoWarsLife.com to find this special and many others in the month of February. Again, InfoWarsLife.com or 888-253-3139. Used since before the days of the Roman Empire to support the body's natural systems and enhance overall health. Introducing the new InfoWarsLife.com oil of oregano formulation, a highly advanced nutraceutical form of this key herb that has been traditionally used by civilizations for thousands of years to promote health. We have now procured the most high quality and potent forms of oregano oil on the market, sourced from top leading manufacturers to ensure a concentrated level of bioactive ingredients extracted directly from the wild herb and sealed in easy to use capsules you will no longer need to endure the burning of liquid oregano on the tongue wild crafted from the mediterranean oregano species that experts agree is one of the most powerful and most challenging to acquire this winter season it's more important than ever to secure this true form of oil of oregano now available in our limited first run at infowarslife.com that's infowarslife.com or call 888-253-3139